welcome again everyone another video i'll be talking about uh what should you do should you find yourself or discover that you're dealing with a narcissist right okay there's some critical things that you need to take into account and be aware of when you decide uh how to move forward once you have discovered it uh there's different scenarios for one if you are if you are a family member of a narcissist and they're in the family and you discover that you're dealing with one and this can be universal across across the board whether it's relationship family or at work uh, number one do not and i repeat do not go and out of anger or out of a sense of relief go and express or or seek to expose them by letting them know that you're on to them and hey you're a narcissist i know you're a narcissist blah 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 you know abc whatever uh don't do that right yeah a major mistake if you do that because although the narcissist may not be aware that they are a narcissist they are aware of their schemes that they're running on people and that they're doing to people and when you start to naming and displaying the things that you've seen them doing uh you are letting them know off offhand that you 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 do see uh the schemes of what they're doing and, and you have found out you know what their uh, true agenda and motives are from that point in that case you you really set yourself up for the narcissist to go and fall back on their plan b uh tactic which is they'll back off they'll they'll typically either go into a, a rage initially um they'll project back onto you usually tell you that you're a narcissist and it, it gets you nowhere honestly it puts you in a in a in a disadvantage because as long as they are left to perceive that you are in the dark and you are completely unaware of them and what they're doing it gives you the advantage of how to outmaneuver them and this works best if you're dealing in a work type environment or situation and that and, you know in that type of situation or if you're stuck with a narcissist and can't necessarily immediately get away uh the worst thing you can do again is to to basically let them know that you're on to them right so you want to kind of have some concealment yourself by not not giving them a heads up on how to either immediately destroy you or slowly destroy you and when i say immediately they can uh you know act and lash out very um irrationally and you know you know put you in a dangerous situation or cause some type of trouble or whatnot um so it's it's important to take that in consideration now the long run if you do do it they can fall back become nice they can they can you know readjust their behavior momentarily with i call it a a um a, a fake epiphany and come back expressing all the things that they've done wrong and that they're going to change and all this and because you're at a, a disadvantage a state of, of being at a disadvantage you're more likely to believe them because either you have to deal with them at work and you just want to make peace and not have all this, you know, this turmoil and hostility going on or you're in a relationship. And because you 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 want to be with that person or you love that you think you love that person, um, you're going to be more willing and apt to to accepting the false or the fake epiphany, which is only. Uh, a decoy to hold you off to suppress uh, your perception and, and, and alter your perception which is perception management of what you thought or what you think you know about them so this is kind of like another tactic of gaslighting 
where the narcissist will act in a way to to get you to kind of kind of back off kind of to make you second guess yourself to be like okay well maybe i had them wrong maybe i jumped the gun maybe it was just a misunderstanding maybe they're not a narcissist right and this this will immediately you know assist the narcissist in, in, in that in that aspect to buy them time but they're buying time to, to, to plot and scheme on you because now it's about destroying you because again they may not specifically know that they're a narc that th- they themselves are uh, are narcissists at least but they do know again the schemes the tactics and the manipulations that they are that they are operating and using on you they are very aware of that okay make no mistake about it they 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 know what they're doing to you all right so they're always using some type of scheme tactic or something of that nature to undermine you so again number one never let them know that you're on to them two once you do find out i mean you have to kind of you have to really go into stealth mode okay you you don't don't let on to the point where you're getting upset because you just found out you know what this all is about and 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 now you know what's up instead use it as intel to work against the narcissist right use it as intel to work against them because if you go into getting upset and and wanting to uh you know start acting differently even though you may not say nothing to them they're going to pick up on your nonverbal cues they're going to pick up on your body language how you're acting and so they're going to know something's off about you right and this is where they'll begin to prying in, in, into getting at the crux or the root of what is really going on with you and some of you may crack and, and, and open up and give out the information of what is actually going on uh, and, 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 ex- and, and bring up that you have discovered them. So the second thing, be mindful of your behavior when you do find out. You Do not change your behavior up abruptly. Continue to be the same person and act the same way. But now you have the, the right intel to restrict okay restrict your engagement with them so that you're not putting out as much or you're not exposing uh your plans or divulging your 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 innermost um you know uh for like a word secrets or whatnot or 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 divulging things that um may may be used against you to compromise uh your position to resist Okay, so you have to be aware that your change in behavior is going to also set them off. Maintain your cool, maintain your calm, continue to operate as you do. But now you know what boundaries, what access points to, to, to shut off or restrict. Okay, you know now how to uh, selectively um agree listen cooperate etc with the individual that may be a narcissist because now that you know you know that you can't fully engage and take everything into account seriously on that level to where you're opening up and putting yourself at a disadvantage um also for the 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 third the third and most important thing is if you can if if the situation permits start working on an exit plan immediately uh start slowly disengaging becoming uh you know disinterested that's use where you're going to start using the gray rock method of of becoming someone who is um you know more or less boring and and uh someone who is not 
easily uh, engageable and, and doesn't feel or feed them any any give them any fuel, right? Um, you you have to cut off and minimize your your contact, your interaction. Always be doing something or doing something that is boring or considered to be non or non interesting that they would want to engage in with you. Uh, cut your time, limit your time with them. You have to do these things if you're in a position where you can't do this and just exit. Uh, the biggest thing is to start altering the way you feel emotionally, right? Use the information again to start, you know, contouring your emotions to 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 uh, being less involved and and hopeful which is a key word because a lot of people are very hopeful in situations when they're dealing with narcissists not understanding that the end result is going to end bad or not in your favor so um just some 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 things to consider uh important that i think you know especially for the holidays anyway guys i'll see you guys next year um i'll take a little break for a while but i will be back with more videos sometime next year and look forward to uh you know continue to give knowledge and understanding to the many that need it happy holidays to everyone be safe out there enjoy yourselves and i th i thank and i appreciate you all for the support thank you for helping the channel grow Please subscribe, like the video as well, um, and share them. You know, some people need this for, for better understanding. Anyway, until next time, guys, happy holidays. Have a wonderful New Year as well. I'll talk to you guys soon.